Are you wondering what to do when the market's going crazy like this? In this video, you and I are going to talk about a strategy that has helped me keep my cool when things are going crazy. Let's go. One, 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 oh, one shot, not a future for sure. Let's go. Yeah. There's a frenzy going on with a correction or whatever they want to call it. And I want to reduce your stress and anxiety levels down. It looks crazy. I shouldn't even be on camera like this. I didn't get ready because I'm running out the door. I'm gonna go see some dolphins and some other dudes who surf. But I wanted to share this with you guys because today is Friday and the markets are down again. I turned on the TV this morning at like 5.30. A lot of frenzy going on. As soon as the market opened, I saw a big red market sell off. What I wanna share with you guys is a strategy where you pick companies that you genuinely believe in. Maybe you use them often. Maybe you just looked at their fundamentals and you see a bright future for them. Whatever it may be on how you evaluate companies, take a look at that. Once you figure that out, you could add $25, $100, a couple hundred dollars every single week towards that stock. Depending on the stock price and how much you want to spend each week, you can buy fractional shares or you can buy whole shares. Once you do that, you just add that same amount of money every single week and then you don't worry so much. The strategy is obviously not for scalping or day trading, the super short term things. It's more of looking at the long term perspective. Say for this particular portfolio, you don't need it for 10, 20, 30 years. Dollar cost averaging has one of the most successful and proven track records in terms of strategies. Benefit of doing dollar cost averaging is that you're not so focused on timing the market. You're really looking at great companies and their future. I know Apple has already had a correction and even if it drops more, say we're way up here. The chances of Apple being higher than your average, which would be right in the middle. So say it drops all the way down to here, but you're doing that strategy every single week. Just based on the history of the market, your chances of it being higher than this point 10 years from now are pretty high. One of the beautiful benefits of this strategy is that you're not so worried about what's going on in the day to day. You're being disciplined in your strategy and you're just executing it. For me, I like to dollar cost average. I'm not worried about it because I believe in these companies that I've picked and I believe in their fundamentals. Until those fundamentals or ownership change, then I'm going to continue to do my dollar cost averaging every single week and in the long term, even in a few years, but definitely 5, 10, 15 years from now, it's just going to exponentially grow. If you add your dividend reinvestment, which is also called a drip, to that strategy, that's where you can really exponentially grow your portfolio. If you're looking to scalp or day trade, which are very short term and advanced strategies, then that's a whole different ball game, a whole different mindset. But the truth is that most investors, like perhaps you or myself, have other things to do throughout the day. Most traders trade within the first two hours and the last hour of the markets being open. Even when I do day trade or scalp, it's still gonna be in that first hour and a half to two hours in the last hour of the markets being open. I feel like in the middle, trends are much harder to spot. Also, I have a lot of other things I wanna work on besides just looking at charts and just watching them go up and down all day. Maybe you guys like investing, you like making money. It's a great way to start off the day and then get to doing whatever you need to get done for the day. Hope this quick tip was helpful for you guys. If it was, hit that like button to let me know or comment below with your favorite stock picks. If you really want to get control of your personal finances or begin investing or continue on your journey of investing, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that you get the latest videos. As always, thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day and we'll talk to you soon. Time to surf!